In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to reinstall Internet Explorer in Vista, which can be useful if you are having problems with the program. To reinstall the program, you are first going to need to uninstall your current installation. Click the Start Orb and then click Control Panel. In the window that loads, click Programs, then Programs and Features. In the menu on the left, click View Installed Updates. In the list that loads, find Windows Internet Explorer and click it, then click the Uninstall button at the top. Click Yes in the dialog box that appears, and then click Continue. The uninstaller will run, and you just need to wait for this to complete. You will need to restart your computer. Click Restart Now. Once the computer has booted again, you are going to need to install IE again. As we have uninstalled Internet Explorer, the chances are something was wrong with it. Therefore, we will download a fresh installation with an alternative browser. Here, we are using Google Chrome. Visit the link that can be found below this page and click the red download button on the page that loads. A file will download and you need to wait for this to complete. When the download has finished, click on the file, then click Continue in the dialog box that appears. Click Install in the next dialog box that opens, and the install will begin. You simply need to wait for this to complete. When this file has finished, you will be prompted to restart your machine. Do this and wait for your computer to boot again. Once it is loaded, you can open your newly installed Internet Explorer, and that is how to reinstall Internet Explorer in Windows Vista.